Hello guys, uh, some people were asking me how to do Google Maps uh, We're showing the location and so on So okay, first of all, we create a page, a project and you have all the information about Google Maps, API keys, how to do them and everything uh, And yeah, you connect it with the, let me show you, with the Firebase here and and that's it and yeah like google maps apis and on the main page on the home page what you do you just drag and drop your google maps here so our google maps is um, somewhere here right wait where is it okay yep here should drag and drop it here done it's working Alright, so here what you need to do, first of all, you go to query collection, your query type is going to be query collection, uh, Firebase query, it's like whatever you call your collection, I call it map, and query type is list of documents, mm, filter nothing is needed here for you, done, so here we did it, okay, uh, then we click on Google map again and on the like property settings, marker document is gonna be our map records from Google Map. For example, if I remove it, I click here and I click map records from Google Map. Cool. And initial location is the current user location. Good, good. Okay, if we go to collections, we see that we have a name of the, uh, of the item and location in let and long data type type so uh, here we did everything we go to actions in the actions what I did I created a bottom sheet so let me show you my bottom sheet so here's the bottom sheet and let me choose the primary text let it be black this one I'm gonna show you right now Let's make it this one. Cool. It's gonna be funny. Uh, elevation two. Okay. Uh, so what we do? Uh, so we drag and drop container inside the container. We drag and drop a column and the text field. So in for the container, what we do? Uh, first of all, wait. Uh, we have a container, but click on the empty space here. We have a parameters, so create a parameter location. Data type uh, type is going to be record, and record type is going to be your collection for map, the map collection, and save it. We go to collection. In the collection, we choose the query type document from reference. Get document from reference collection map. Source location is our parameter, and available option is reference. Done. And for the text, I choose uh, map record from container and name, save. So now we go back to the map. In the map, on the action, on marker tab, uh, for example, I just click here. Uh, we have a, a bot, we call a bottom sheet, okay. We need to call bottom sheet, where is that bottom sheet? Uh, yep, this on bottom sheet, display comp component location info, height, let's, let's be like 300. Uh, this one, let me make it transparent, and this one is also transparent. Uh, parameters, we send the parameter uh, location, the one we created in the component, and source gonna be marker record. <coughs> Done. Close. And um, that's it. Ah, yeah. So marker documents gonna be mar map records from Google Map, and uh, its location, the current initial location, global properties, current user location. Save it. And now, yeah. And here, let me show you how to use this one. So we go to the Firestore, manage content. Let it load. Okay, 
so here you see I have two locations let's add one more location name is gonna be London and we click here and we write London London Ontario Canada like UK done save sometimes it shows like let, let's see if we choose for the Moscow there are some box it has and I want to show it to you how to solve it mm, no box okay sometimes you will see here like a lot of nines all right sometimes it shows like this so what you do you delete all the nines and add document done and now we can go uh, yes by the way here everything explained very quickly so I checked it out here how to use it I mean I did use it before but I forgot it how to so I checked it out here please use also docs.flutterflow.io for more information because sometimes I don't have a lot of time to create videos and today I got some free time so that's why I'm creating it yeah and now we can run it now we wait okay so now we see that okay this is it shows my location but it doesn't show the pin uh, so if we decrease it zoom out so now we have like London we have Berlin we have Moscow we have Nur Sultan done so good luck enjoy it if you have questions something like oh dude can you show me how to make a way so i can like build a path from point a to point b mm, i don't think this is like possible for now but maybe in the future they will be able to do so but right now unfortunately no yeah please uh, like it like the video comment it say how cool it was and yeah if you have any questions just write it down i'm gonna try to answer it as soon as possible bye bye